Welcome back everyone, I'm Craven, and this is Tales of Vesperia and you might wonder why are we still here? Well, at the end of the last episode afterwards I wanted to just do a few things and then make my way back like resting at the inn. But the moment I started doing that, well, I got a scene and of course know me, you know that I don't want to uh, show myself scenes that I cannot uh, record so I instantly backed out of it and here we are. So before we head back to where we're supposed to be, let's head back into town, sleep at the inn and watch that scene and hopefully it, it will still show up because I'm not going to assume that it's a scene that can happen at any inn you stay at because I think this is one of those towns where we did not sleep at the inn so that might have been a reason why we got why what we got. Uh, and while we here, do I need... Nope, lenses are perfectly on par. Do we want some extra food? Yeah, we have, we have plenty of money, so we can definitely afford that. Alright, let's go to the inn and see if the scene is still there. Wow, what a strange group of people, a dog and even a couple of kids. And they don't look like they're related either. Well, as the gateway uh, to all of Tol, uh, Bikia, Capua Torum sees its fair share of interesting folk. A motley crew like theirs isn't too uncommon among all the guides, uh, guilds that uh, pass through here. But I could swear that I've seen a young man somewhere before. You too, ma'am. To tell the truth, he does look familiar to me too. I wonder where I've seen his face. Oh, your room is the last one down, on the right. Have a pleasant stay. Sure, thanks. Yeah. Is the wanted man really hiding in here? I'm sure. I thought I'd seen him somewhere before and then I spotted the wanted poster. I immediately knew it was him. That room up ahead. Hmm, alright. You stand back. Yes, of course. Yeah, so basically... Uh, Somebody recognized Yuri and uh, tried to get the reward. So this is a scene that should have probably played before he went to Heliord. But uh, I still wanted to put it in here. Man, look how cute uh, Rita is sleeping with Estelle. Hey, wake up. Mm, what do you want? It's the middle of the night. Oh, not too much milk on my cereal. No, it'll get soggy. I said wake up Carol, we have to get out of here. The wanted man has three friends with him, they all got a dog, so be careful. Well, an imperial knight won't be beaten by the likes of a common criminal. Estelle, kid, wake up. Alright, put your hands up and come qui- Huh? Ah, oh, they get away. Well, what was that all about? Well, it looks like somebody snitched on us. Snitched? Oh, you're too well known for your own good, Yuri. Hey, isn't the guilt influence really strong in Torum? Maybe the knight was just overcompensating for how impotent he must feel. Yuri, that knight was just trying to do his job. I'd appreciate if you kept your insult to yourself. Uh, I'm never gonna be able to get a good knight to sleep at this rate. Well, at least we got away without getting caught, right? We can be uh, happy about that. Happy? This is annoying as all hell. The next time we stay at an inn, you can sleep outside with the dog. I wonder if we continue going the way we are supposed to, because basically they... Well, annulled all the charges against us, isn't it? So we shouldn't get chased anymore. But we'll see. It does mean that uh, at every inn we uh, go to, go past at least, I want to sleep there now. Just if, just to see if there is a, a scene or not. So for now, we need to uh, make all the way back to Heliord. And when we get to out of the other side, we'll continue the main game. So I'll see you when we get to Heliord. 
we're back in town again and the weather is shit <laughs> it's raining real hard uh, let's see if we can go to HQ and afterwards we are gonna get out of here because we did get our mission that's to protect the princess on the, her journey at least for a little bit longer but we did say that uh, we'd be doing that after we've done our own personal stuff and that is uh, potentially making a guild with Carol a guild that uh, well technically he cannot get kicked out of that's basically it isn't it and we still cannot go down well I don't want to be in this dangerous place anymore that's right I'll change jobs it's the safest possible place where in this world would that place be? <laughs> well, if Blastia course can just blow up when something happens, then no place is actually safe, is it? Right, out at the other side, and that is, I think, our next location, isn't it? Unless we get a marker on the map somewhere. And if we see uh, monsters that we haven't recognized before. Hmm, is there a way for us to get up there? That's the question. I don't think so. What is that? Seems like a tower into a sandstorm or something. Uh, not yet. Let's just first uh, give them a good scan. definitely a tower in there I'm guessing next uh, location for us to travel to and let's see if we can find as many different uh, new enemies uh, here so we can scan them and replace our lenses before going to a new location nowadays and do we want to check out your equipment if they are Ooh, gladius is that... mm. for him that is the strongest good It's a big town. This is Dongrest, my hometown. The Den of Guilds, Dongrest. Looks like a pretty lively place. Well, it's the second largest city after the Imperial Capital. It's run entirely by the guilds. I thought it'd be more dark and dank, you know? Like a den of villains. That's just a prejudice people have about the guilds. I'm sure the bad reputation of the Blood Alliance is to blame for that. Yeah! Jeez, Yuri, you make it sound like I'm a villain. Who knows? Maybe you are, cause you do tend to run away in the most uh, dangerous situations and leave your party there to die. It is what a villain would do. If you're a villain, what does that make him? Point taken. So, how should we go about tracking down Barbos? The best way is probably to stop by the Union and check there. The Union? 
A guild collective run by the five so-called master guilds, right? Yeah. The Union also serves as the city's government. But how is this gonna work? Isn't Barbos's Blood Alliance one of the five master guilds? Which means if we lay a hand on him, we'll be picking a fight with the Union as well. We won't know the answer to that until we ask the Dawn. The Dawn is the boss of the Union, isn't he? Yep. Dawn Whitehorse, leader of Altosk, the most powerful of the five master guilds. All right, let's go see what the Dawn has to say then. You know the way, right, Carol? Hey, wait. He's not the kind of person you can just meet. I don't really know if... Please? Union headquarters is in the north part of town. He's not looking forward to it, is he? But for us, he will? Well, the air around this town is unstable, reflecting the sunlight and turning the sky red. Well, no one knows why the air has been so unstable. So, now in town, it's perpetual sunset. It's kind of sad and depressing. Unless you like sunsets. Well, I'm glad the Dawn can keep this place lively, but I wish we'd uh, go take uh, out the Empire already. Surely Barbos will stand against them. I'm gonna stand on the sides. Oh, you there, sir! Our merchandise is top quality, take a look, see for yourself. Hey now, everyone's welcome to browse, come on in and drop some gold. Alright. Oh, I'm gonna join Fortin Market when I grow up. A merchant needs to know his math, and I'm gonna start studying right now. Well, good day. Do you want to know what's synthesizing? Today's suggestions are... Ooh, medium-sized bag, sparkle. Yeah, I think we're now gonna get uh, a synthesis for everybody's uh, secondary, uh, well, arm. Welcome, this store is number one of Fortune Marcus headquarters. Alright. And two. And of course, we'll be buying stuff for as best as we can. And as long as the money is still there. <laughs> if we're gonna get in trouble for money, we'll definitely just have to have a grinding session between the episodes, which shouldn't be too bad, I reckon. And a thief's cape. Slightly raises agility. Yeah, I really need to... Uh, Take a moment and check up on all those accessories and see which one uh, fits me best. Uh, he's still busy with uh, that. Nothing new for him. On any front. He's still busy with that. This, there it is, the Iron Hammer. Mm. I'm more curious when the, there's gonna be like an item to increase my stats, because that will be the time that uh, I'm really gonna go hard on that synthesis process. Uh, for now, Carillion Hammer, we need Redlands to do that. So many weapons uh, yet. I'm guessing we don't have the half quarter minimum. So Red Lance is something that's definitely gonna have to be coming back and Mystic Cloth as well. Tsurugi. Hmm. Ah, okay, so strength becomes strength 2 in taunt 2. Because these ones we have. Uh, why can't I make this? 
Oh, <laughs> my money is gone. Yeah, that that's definitely gonna be an issue. Uh, Red lands. We have this one, and this is also just a money issue. But we do want it because it does have some moves that we don't have on anything else just yet. And we do have the items, but the water is a bit on the low side. But that should be no. I think we... no, it should be fine. All right. We might need to find one more. Uh, this is, of course, for a thousand medium sized bag. Damn. Um, yeah, and these are just uh, for the heck of it. Ooh. Shoes decorated with uh, wings increases speed for those in a hurry. Permanently for our team. Ooh. Okay, so if we find birds, we need to fight a couple of them a little bit more so we can get at least one more medium. And after that, it's just a uh, money thing. Oh, thank you very much. Please come back anytime. Uh, Alright. Oh, my mom is a guild big shot, really. I even met the Don. And the Don's an even bigger big shot, not just anybody can meet him. Oh, say so you folks there, how would you like a rest? We're fully sanctioned by the Inn Guild. You'll uh, feel like you slept three days in one night. Dinner's on us, don't miss your chance. You'll feel like you slept three days in one night. Well, I will once I've earned a little bit more cash, cause I am, I am poor right now. Be careful, the brighter the light, the darker the shadows. Don't go walking into any alleys. Don't whine if you get yourself killed, that's dang rest. Oh, I came here with my husband, but I had no idea there was such a large town. This place really has a different energy than Safias. And yes, I just chose a, just a random direction. <laughs> and hopefully we'll uh, take the long route around and can talk to as many people as possible. Ooh. I'm guessing that big picture is the leading chef at the moment. I can't get through that door. Well, welcome to the Gourmet Banquet Bistro Black Hole Cooking Stadium. The days without uh, events are open to the public, so we hope you enjoy yourself. At our ingredient corner, we provide our best ingredients and seasonings. They're the finest quality, but there's a shortage, so we're all sold out. I'm terribly sorry. Hmm, the best ingredients. Kitchen and chef that can be, can be. The result has to be delicious. But if I even if one of those is missing, you cannot make a fine meal. Oh, this pot uses master artisan steel made by the soulsmiths. It conduit, conducts and restains heat better than anything else out there. Ah, okay, so that's something we need. Ooh, I just a small... <laughs> hey, I'm not an ingredient, so don't try anything funny. I'm trying to become a master chef. It's mostly been eating uh, so far, you know. Uh, oh, are they trying to fatten me up to eat me? No, of course not. Quit joking around or I'll cut you up and put you in a stew. Uh, maybe there is a uh, thought, of, thought or two uh, out there considering eating the cow. Well, I heard I could buy all the best ingredients here, so here I am. But everything was sold out when it got here too bad. They say they've been having trouble on their trade routes recently. I just hope somebody does something soon. Well, only a handful of people can sit in one of these chairs. I'd like to sit there and dine one day. But I wouldn't want to be stared at by someone in the seat while I cook. I'd be so nervous I end up serving my hand. Well, I'm sure in certain uh, cultures that would be a delicacy. If you clean your hands first, of course. Bonjour, welcome to the Guild Gourmet Banquet. Our fine selection is so popular that everything is sold out. Pardon. Merci. Please, come again. Au revoir. 
Okay, well, I'm guessing there's gonna be a place where later in the game we're gonna have food fights depending on our level with the food creation. Which I cannot guarantee we will max out in this playthrough because that's gonna take a lot of work. And for now, since this is our first um, Tales game on the channel, I wanna mainly focus on uh, the story and afterwards we can do as much as we can if we have the fortitude to do so. Uh, return to the field map, not yet. <laughs> I want to complete this town uh, first. Welcome, we'll you be staying. There will be 400 gold. Stop by again sometime. Well, welcome to story number two. We are renting out this space. Uh, will they have anything else? Mm. This is new? We did buy it. Yeah, we did. We just need to equip it. Before I hands for get Good. And of course, Synesis is still the same. Thanks. Everything we sell here is just the same as the number one store. <laughs> yeah, but now people can... Um, ooh, something is stuck. The drawer won't open. Okay. Uh, but yes, that way you can have, buy your selection on two different places. People might even think the other, one of the two is cheaper than the other, even though we know it's not true. There's probably some uh, business sense to it, isn't it? Well, step right up, fix your eyes on these wares, you can't buy stuff like this in the Empire. Oh, hey, what do you think you're doing? Just wandering around? Well, you got a problem, buddy? Oh, Danquist is a city of guilt. It's probably the freest uh, place on Earth. All those uh, stuffy old Empire types should go back and huddle together on their own turf. Well, sir. You might want to stop uh, goggling and everything. It's obvious you're not from around here. I don't know where you're from, but not everyone in Dengris is nice. I imagine so. Hey, what are you doing? I think Carol is looking out that he doesn't come across any any of the hunting blades. Because uh, I don't think he can face them now, knowing that they know he ran away again. What? Uh, n nothing. Hmm? Well, well, if it ain't little Carol. What the hell are you thinking coming back here? Hey, what's with you? Yeah, I don't see Nan. She already did you? <laughs> no way. She wouldn't stop nagging, so I took off. This would explain why Carol wasn't too eager to go to Dongrist. So are you the latest guild to take him in? You could do a lot better than that, loser. All this kid can brag about is the number of guilds he's joined. Oh, right. That's a bad thing. Are these your friends, Carol? You could do a lot better than these losers. W what did you say? Such undignified men. Shut up. You sure have a way of saying things. I mean, you're right, but... Yeah, you just keep talking. What's that sound? Damn it. They're back again. Come on. Who are back Alarm. again? Monsters are here. Ooh. Monsters? Wait, is this shaking the monsters' footsteps? If so, they've brought quite an army. Yeah, but don't worry. Even if there have been a lot of monsters around here lately, our barrier here is strong, and it's never been broken before. And the guilds take care of the monsters outside the barrier. Ooh. Huh? Oh crap! Oh, that's not good. The barrier disappeared. What the hell is going on? The monsters are gonna get inside. Damn it! Why do things like this always happen to me? No matter where I go. <laughs> Yuri, the sort of old blots you're breaking. You gotta be cursed. Maybe. Yuri, we have to go stop the monsters. Alright, I'm guessing where we have to go. 
Hmm, hunting the monsters is our job. It ain't funny if other girls try to muscle in our territory. We hunting blades will lose face if the monsters defeat us. What? What's going on? Why would the barrier fail? Whoa, 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 whoa. What the hell is this? What the hell's going on? We'll be fine. The Don will do something about this. This town has always been that way. There's nothing to worry about. Uh, where will the monsters be? Can we go through the entirety of town or will we be stopped at some point at least? What are the monsters doing in the town? Did the Empire do this? The Guild Union. <laughs> yes, we can go anywhere. And we shall, because new texts. What? Monsters? What a great opportunity! Our guild's first job! Let's go! We're going to defend this town! Beyond this point are the private rooms of the Union officials. You can exit from the left. You're not allowed past this point. Ah, oh, guess you found me. You're pretty good. I'll teach you the good quest of reward. <laughs> Minestrone soup. I'll give you this so you can practice. Another three cents. Gotta go. Till we meet again. Till we meet again, sir. Oh, I don't need a weakling like you. A pack of monsters is headed this way. Well, we have to bury it, don't we? What? The bear is gone? Oh, what are we gonna do? The pack of monsters are common occurrence, but now then there's no barrier. Yeah, they might get in. You ain't uh, going any further. Well, stop me then. Oh, shut your hole and leave me be. You want uh, in there, Debbie? Then go start some trouble outside. You'll wind up in here for sure. Okay, so it's not saying we're not allowed inside. We're only allowed inside if we have made trouble. Which is kind of logical when it uh, comes to a prison, doesn't it? I'm guessing this is where the union leader will be at. And one seat for every leader of the other guilds. No, I do hope. Oh, you looked in the pot. Your face is turning red. Yes, for the heat. Yeah, because I do want to help everyone, but uh, having separate tax just uh, in a situation like this, which is unique, because it will change as soon as we uh, solve it. The monster are coming from the exit. Uh, okay, so there is a point that uh, the game will say, nope. Help! My legs won't move! What? What's going on? Hey, we got to get our out of here. Just don't break any of the merchants on the way out. Hmm, the, the barrier broke? Oh, that's impossible. It's the Empire behind this. Well, you got a problem, buddy? Well, run away now. would be an insult to merchants everywhere. Business is life. You got a problem with that? No. Oh, that's a lot of monsters. This is crazy. Where are all these monsters coming from? Something isn't right. Yeah, I think the barrier is attracting them instead of repelling. Doesn't something seem different about the monsters as well? Here they come. Oh, old rhinoceros is. This. This money can be used to uh, sleep in a moment. Borfer. Damn it! It's just one right after the other. Don't get sloppy. Ha, ha, 
Oh, those are new ones. Alright, Beetle. Did you notice that I was uh, scanning on you? I'm guessing that symbol is from somebody else. That's why I can't trigger it. Ah, uh, give me some Tobeki and water. The leader of the Angrest would be a proper introduction, wouldn't it? That old guy is really going after him. Who the hell is he? It's the Don. That's Don Whitehorse. I knew it. It had to be. So that's him, huh? It's the Don. The Don's here. Let's kick this monster scum out of here. Defend the city. Nobody messes with the clouds of Dawn. Wait. There was Flynn. We've come to help subdue the monsters. Hold your horses, night boy. We couldn't live with ourselves if we let the knights do our dirty work. Now get the hell out of here. Yeah, you're no welcome here. Is this really the time for that? Yes. Each and every one of these people left the empire of their own free will and joined a guild. <laughs> there ain't a soul in this town so spineless they go running to you guys for help. But... These are the rules of the life we've chosen. It's up to us to make sure those rules don't get broken. Holding to your beliefs no matter what's at stake. So that's what a real guild is like. I think Yuri, Yuri can appreciate that. Hey, you there. Lead the way. I have a name, you know. Where are we going anyway? We're going to repair the barrier, Blastia. If we don't, the city will be overrun with monsters. You're coming too. I guess that's my only option. Yeah, you gotta protect uh, Astelis. Cause this was the order you got. The barrier failed right as the monsters appeared? What the hell is going on in this city? I've lived in Dongress my whole life, but I've never seen anything like this. So why the hell do we have such terrible timing? How should I know? What? You don't really think I'm cursed, do you? No, personally, I think it's a staged attack. Someone let the monsters here and then destroyed the barrier, or at least interrupted it for the time being. Oh, the barrier broke. That's impossible. The Empire is behind this. Let's hurt to the barrier blast, yeah. Uh, I'm guessing that's in the region we weren't allowed to yet? Yes, of course. Ain't no knights here. We, the guilds, protect this town. You all gotta be ready for the worst. Well, I, I have lived in this town for many years, but I have never seen the barrier fail. But in this town, it's my town. I just strive to protect it with my life. Very, very honorable. The Don Desk. Various types of books are piled up here. Ah, so he runs this place from the inn? Nice. Holy bottle. Ah, oh, to fight or not to fight? That's the question. But uh, thinking about it, it doesn't bring any answers. What would the best if the monsters went away while I'm thinking about it? Yeah, that does mean that you're a coward. Uh, who made this world into a place where one can't even eat in peace? Damn it! Blame the Union! Would you let me eat in peace? Yeah, so basically uh, people live here, living off the Union and expecting them to solve everything without lifting a hand themselves. Uh, the barriers appeared. How should I respond to the situation? There's no way the monster could bring this town down, right? Well, I've conquered countless obstacles to get where I am. That's why I'm not afraid of any monsters. In my opinion, there's nothing rougher than being alive. What? What's the commotion about? Is it true? 
Oh, the monsters can cross the barrier. What? The barrier is gone? Oh, this is a disaster. The barrier disappeared? No good. No good. No, what the barrier has failed. I guess I'll prepare my escape. I'm so totally in love with these raiders right now. I'm not going to run away just because of some monsters. I'm just here for a visit, and the barrier disappeared. <laughs> Talk about bad luck. I'm just really unlucky. Yeah, really unlucky. <laughs> what? Hey, I'm having a good time over here. A stiff drink in the afternoon is the best. It is. When there are no monsters attacking your town. Oh, young people nowadays striding into bars in the middle of the day. Me? I can come whenever I like. I'm an old man. Yeah, <laughs> the only thing you have to live for is what's coming at the end. <laughs> I'm not saying that's what all old people have, but that's what this old guy is uh, meaning, of course. Um, nothing? We're too late. This is so horrible. Out of the way! <laughs> Nobody hurts her, Blastias. Hmm. I might be able to do something with this. Rita, watch out! Behind you! We won't let you fix the barrier! Ah, so I'm guessing we know who's the culprit now. What the hell? It's just one thing after another. I'm sick of this! Then let's wipe them out. Let's get this over with. Bronze, bronze, and zinc. Alright, so there are two. Not too bad. Hey, well, Ooh, some red lenses, nice, we need that. Looks like we have those guys to thank for the barrier blastia failing on us. But why? Looks like you've got your hands full over here. So the Don's little lecture didn't stick? I'm just doing what I can to help. How's the repair of the barrier blastia going? That'll depend on our genius mage here. Mm, the core is still there. They just fiddled with your formula a bit and stopped it, didn't they? What the? This is an amplifier? Yeah, and I guess that's an amplifier to attract the monsters. And this formula again. The same as they were using back on Amid Hill. The barrier disappeared when the monsters attacked. It can't be a coincidence that they happen at the same time, can it? Probably not. So does your appearance here mean this is tied up with all the Empire's problems? I don't know. That's why I came here to check things out. That goes there, and this goes here. Yeah, thinks he succeeded. That's our Rita. Alright, time to clean up the monsters outside the barrier. The guilds won't be able to complain if we fight monsters outside the city. That is true. And it will help. We'll lead the monsters to Flan. Let's go to the Union and ask about Barbos. Yeah, maybe get a little bit of a reward for it. Because <laughs> we did well. You really trust Flynn, don't you? Only because there's no one else I can trust. That's how I look at it. Well, come on, Yuri. Estelle, I think you can trust her too. Yuri? I don't get you sometimes. <laughs> That's the entire thing, isn't it? How many guilds are there in this city? I don't know the exact number, but I think there are more than a hundred. Whoa, that many? Are all of them in the Union? <clears throat> nah, not all of them, but I guess around 90% of them are Union members. Wow, and the Dawn's at the top of them all. That guy's amazing. 
That's why he's the Dawn! What are you so proud about? The Dawn's the amazing one, not you. <laughs> yeah, because you've been kicked out of every guild imaginable. Uh, yeah, I know I shouldn't rub it in with Carol, but come on. It is true. <laughs> well, I'm so pleased the bear is back in operation. Now we can rest easy. You want to see the dawn? There's no way the dawn would meet with kids like you. Yeah, but is he gonna be in here? If so, I might go out and first look at around the rest of town. Uh, he's not here yet, so he might be all up front. Oh, the monster went away while I was still wondering whether or not to fight. I guess that's what I was asking for, but I'm a little disappointed. I'm a little disappointed I didn't get to show what I can do. Well, it's your own damn fault, then you should have just uh, went out there and helped people. Uh, what? The barrier got fixed? Oh, then I didn't have to eat so fast. Dongress has a very different atmosphere from the capital, doesn't it? Oh, definitely. The city seems so energetic. Everyone here is so full of life. Of course! It's the largest guild city. Everyone lives according to their own principles. Do you like Dongress, Estelle? Yes, I think it's lovely. What about you, Yuri? Hmm? I think it'd be a really great city if the barrier wasn't crapping out. Yuri, will you please let that go? I'm kidding. The city's not bad at all. It even feels kind of like the lower quarter. <laughs> a little less rules. <laughs> I think that's mostly, uh, mostly what he's talking about. Oh, they say someone tampered with the barrier blast, yeah. We'll, we'll have to put the barrier blast under much heavier guard from now on. Oh, most definitely. Ooh, Penisea. Well, have you heard? The barrier failed the monster attacked. Oh, you already know that. Yeah, we didn't stay in here. Well, I'm not going anywhere if the barrier fails. I'm not taking my eyes off this waitress. If I can die looking at her beautiful face, <laughs> I can die happy. What about the person who controls the Union? What is Don Whitehorse like? In a word, big. Big voice, big body, big everything. We already know what he looks and sounds like. We saw him, remember? Oh yeah, that's right. Well, he's a really cool person. Does that answer your question, Estelle? It's clear that Carol has a lot of respect for the Dawn. But that's about the only thing that's clear. He's so cool that it can't be expressed in words. <laughs> we'll just leave it at that then. Very cool. Well, the barrier was fixed. Don can breathe a sigh of relief. I can have a good drink here. Maybe uh, luck has turned a little. Well, it seems we drove all the monsters away. I'm so relieved. Hmm, I'm the owner here. Can I get you anything? Hey, don't try anything on the part-timer. Oh, even without a barrier, when can the... be as old as me, you can still live on. I'm not afraid of any monsters. What scared me most is my cowardly soul that's scared of monsters. And that's why he's always at the tavern. Alright, so we're gonna leave the episode here. Uh, on the next one we'll explore the rest of the town until we find out where the Dawn is. And then we're gonna have a little chat with him. Uh, well, tell him what happened, who was after the barrier at least. And possibly also the reason why the monster attack. Cause if they attack before the barrier broke down, there has to be something else that was triggering it. And the amplifier we mentioned, that might have been the cause of it. And it's the same thing you said before with Emmett Hill and stuff like that. Like, too many formulas build upon each other to work together and the blast check can't take it. But is that just what they want? An unstable blast jam that will destroy things in somebody's favor. But who's? That's something we need to figure out. But uh, for now, I wish you all a great night, morning, day, wherever you are. And if you're still here, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and be back next time as we continue on looking through Dungrest in search of the dawn. See you then. Bye bye.